Hello and welcome friends. Welcome to another unboxing video. I just uh, received this uh, large envelope from the courier and I'm quite excited to see its content. Well, um, I like the way it is uh, packed um, and I will use my scissors to carefully open it. Okay. So let me see the content. Yes, inside it I have another little package. And let me see. I will use the scissors to uh to see what we have. And here another another package. It is wrapped with this. Okay. And yes, I have the beautiful, beautiful fountain pen here. And um, I'm sorry, guys. I'm um, filming this in. Uh, these conditions of light let me put it to the light and let's give it a zoom you can see a beautiful beautiful pelican and this is the pelican m800 a beautiful beautiful fountain pen let me show you the wonderful wonderful nib of this wonderful writing instrument it has a little bit of water. Uh, this has a wonderful 18 carat 750 M nib. A beautiful, beautiful M nib, as you can see. And um, I'm uh, particularly interested in the shape of this ring. In my opinion, it is the weak point of this beautiful fountain pen. So in time, if you don't treat it with uh, careful, this ring might corrode if you leave it uh, with ink. Let me admire it. Look at this beautiful green ink window. It has a piston filling mechanism and let's see if it works. We will uh, see if it works. Yes, you can see it. This is just an unboxing and uh, I will do a writing sample in uh, the next video. As a comparison, because you know I have lots and lots of uh, fountain pens, I have an original M800 from uh, the 1987 or 1988. This you can see doesn't have the ink window, but you can see it's tr uh, quite transparent. and. What uh, are the main um, differences between those two models? Let me briefly show them to you. So this is a 14 karat uh, gold nib. This is an 18 karat gold nib. Uh, this ring was corroded in time and um, it simply uh, came off during the cleaning procedure. We have the same two rings. Interesting, on the 1987 or the 1988 model, we have this um, plaque, this golden plaque. On later models, we don't have this uh, golden cap. The feed, you can see, is the same. We will check out the caps. So, uh, on the new fountain pen, we just have Germany, Pelican, Sovran. And on the old cap, we have West Germany, Pelican Souvran. Look at the logo. So we have a painted logo here. That means that this M800 was built after 1997, when they made this transition from the, from, uh, the engraved logo with two cheeks to the simple painted logo 
So guys, I'm quite excited about this uh, latest acquisition. It uh, wasn't cheap. I paid uh, for it uh, around um, 1300 lays, which means I paid for it 267 euros or 323 American dollars. So uh, not quite an um, affordable fountain pen, but a beautiful, beautiful fountain pen. And um, one of my favorites from Pelican. You can see the newer version is slightly longer than uh, the version from 1987 and 1988. So guys, stay tuned to my channel because there will be two videos. One where I will review this M800 uh, Black and uh, another interesting video where I will compare in depth uh, the two versions of the M800. Thank you for your time, guys. Wherever you are, I wish you to have a nice day. I will see you again at the next episode. If, um, if you want to support my activity, please uh, subscribe to this channel for more interesting fountain pens. I wish you a nice day and bye-bye.